Hey guys, welcome back. It's Tal here and I'm back for another video for you guys. It is a beautiful spring day, quickly moving into summer here in Minnesota and um, that means shopping. So uh, I went out today and went a little crazy getting a bunch of new stuff. Um, some of it is like kind of random household stuff. Some of it I actually am going to bring into work to keep at my desk and then I also got a couple new summer slash spring outfits. So I thought I would do an unboxing with you guys. Um, of just kind of like a summer haul and the two stores I'm going to be featuring in this video is Burlington and Rue 21. Um, so I think I'll start with the Burlington bag so we will just like dig right in and I'll show you everything that I got. Alright so I got a couple Burlington bags. They're kind of huge and kind of like full of stuff. And I got a ton of stuff or whatever. I absolutely love shopping at Burlington. Um, this is not a sponsored video in any way. I just love giving you guys my thoughts. Um, I discovered Burlington like about a year ago. I mean obviously I'd heard of it before. It was Burlington Coat Factory for like a super long time. They just rebranded themselves and now they're just Burlington. They still sell coats there at like a good price usually but that's not their main focus anymore. They're kind of more like like a TJ Maxx but cheaper which I didn't know was possible. So um, I kind of really love it. There isn't one super close to me. The closest one is like 20 minutes away so it's a bit of a drive so normally I have to have some free time if I want to go. Um, especially because it's also set up like a TJ Maxx where it's one of those you have to like make the time go in really search for the really good stuff and you have to kind of like go through racks and all through the shelving and stuff but they have like everything there you could think of. They have like um, both men's and women's like jewelry, clothes, um, hair accessories, they have some makeup that's like randomly off-branded. Um, and it's not like off-brand stuff like you get a lot of like really good stuff and I think they're just like kind of like a clearance center. I think basically what happens is that like big brands that are having a hard time selling stock or like overstock stuff or whatever will send it to them so that um, at least they get some profit off of it and then they will mark down the prices like super low and then um, you just end up getting like a really great deal for something and so if you're not like looking for like the necessarily next best thing and you're just looking for something that's more your style. Um, I, I think that it's just really awesome. Uh, so yeah, so I like I said, I kind of got a bunch of really random stuff. Um, they're all across the board. I'll let you guys kind of know like what the original pricing was had you bought it from the regular retailer and then what I got from it at Burlington. Um, and yeah, so digging into the bag here, the first big thing I got was a new purse. Um, the purse I am currently wearing I actually inherited from my aunt and I haven't gotten a new purse in probably, gosh, it's probably been like two or three years since I got a new purse. It's been a really long time so I've been kind of like searching around for a couple months here knowing that I wanted something new but I didn't exactly know what it was. I decided on getting a shoulder bag. Um, so this is what it looks like here. Um, this is from the brand Rosetti. It has a um, decently sized um, and it has a shoulder strap on it and it's one of those ones that's gonna like fit under your shoulders and kind of hit you at the hip but you're not gonna like open it up super wide and like have it as like a shoulder strap like over the over the shoulder and across. This will like just be here. Um, I usually bring a lot of stuff to work on almost a daily basis whether it's like a new drink or my food for the day or whatever but I don't always like bringing a sock or bag. Um, so if it's just one or two things I like throwing it in my purse so having a larger purse really works for me. Um, otherwise um, if it's going to be a ton of stuff I'll like grab my purse and then put everything in a separate bag. Normally my Victoria's Secret bag honestly. Um, but yeah so like I said it has like one really big pocket here, another like kind of hidden pocket here. Normally I put like lady things in there like tampons and pads and stuff. And then we have two big pockets here. Um, I love that this one's open so I could throw my cell phone in here and have it easy use. And then a closed one as well. So it retailed from Rosetti for $45. I paid $17 for it. So $17 for a new one. This will last me a year, probably two at least. Um, and yeah, just something kind of fun and new um, for the shoulder bag. Okay, so digging right back in here, the next thing I picked up are some more um, um, makeup wipes. Um, this one is al has aloe extract in it. I love things that have um, like either cucumber or aloe or something really soothing like that in the makeup wipes. Um, nothing that's going to be like too overwhelming. Like I kind of usually stick away from like lavender or um, like the really florally scents but something that's really really 
like cooling I'll um, use and I especially for stuff that's like either getting rid of swatches or um, just like a quick getting rid of like the base makeup before I cleanse and like ever do everything with my face I don't really care as much about the brand as much for this as long as it does a decent job um, these originally would have retailed for eight dollars and I got them for four so they were half off so again a really great deal and I can always use more makeup wipes all right so the next thing I got was a new pair of shoes um, the shoes I've been wearing for the last oh gosh probably a couple of years are completely falling apart there's a hole in the bottom of them right now and I knew what I needed to get new ones um, so I've been kind of looking around and I was just looking for something that's gonna be like a daily shoe that I can just like slip on and go out the door and it'll be like kind of cute and go with almost any outfit but not like a heel or a flat or something just like a regular shoe um, so the ones I ended up finding that I uh, wanted to get are from the brand Skechers um, I've uh, gotten Skechers before. These ones um, have memory foam in the bottom of them so when I tried them on they were super super comfortable. Um, they have those laces that are already set in here. There's no actual tying so you just slip your foot right in and you're good to go. You don't have to worry about like untying your retying laces at all but it still has that effect of like a regular shoe. Um, they're very very lightweight which is um, obviously partially due to that memory foam you don't have a lot of like extra material in there these would have retailed for $55 and I got them for $35 um, which if I'm gonna get anything for under 40 bucks for a decent shoe like this and I like I said I trust Skechers I've gotten them before um, I think that's a pretty good deal so I am happy with the new shoes I got all right one big down one big to go the first thing that I'm pulling out is just completely random household that I knew that we needed and it is a new storage container um this is just from the brand good cook and it's um specifically i got it for cereal um we've been recently really stocking up on, on dry cereal lately and i hate opening up more than one bag and not going through it quick enough so that it kind of like dries out and you kind of get it stale so i much rather would invest in these open it up pour it in right away and then it's going to stay um good for a while um and we have like two of these i think for cereal right now but me and nate usually eat very different cereals so um i knew i wanted to get a third one here um normally i'll have at least two open at once um so then at least we can each have one open before he does so this will come in use right away this would have originally retailed for ten dollars and i got it for six today so again great deal and i will get many many uses and definitely get my six bucks worth out of this um, the next thing again is completely random household um and it is a new tablecloth um i the table we currently own is something we picked up I think at like a garage sale a couple of years ago. The actual surface of it like is not good at all. It needs to be restained. There's scratches in it. There's like marker marks on it. There, some of the wood's actually like peeling off. It's not a pretty table but it serves its purpose for us right now. Um, to alleviate the actual like hardware around it since it doesn't look very good I'm really into just putting like a cute tablecloth on it um, so I it still has all of the necessary function but it, it's a little cuter and like looks a little nicer in the apartment um, so this one that I found here is from the brand Brighton Gardens um, I really liked the pattern I thought it was really cute and this originally retailed for eight dollars and I got it for five dollars so again a really good deal and I'll get my use out of it I'll probably use this throughout the whole summer Okay, so the next thing that I got was definitely an impulse buy. Uh, I wanted something that was just going to be for me, and with summer coming, um, I knew I would want something just fun and relaxing and maybe get a couple spa days in here, so I thought I'd pick up a couple bath bombs. I got the mini ones. Um, I never take super long baths. I always get in the mood for them, but then I'm in there for like 15 or 20 minutes max. I don't need one one of those ones the size of your fist to like make me last forever. I'm perfectly content with the smaller one here. Um, I thought this would be a really nice uh, variety. Um, the ones that I picked up are from the brand Air and & Water and you get six of them and they are revitalizing bath bombs. Um, the f um, scents that I got in this is Lavender Fields, Chamomile, and Rosebud. Um, so I think that they'll all be very relaxing and definitely um, serve their purpose. Um, they originally retailed for $10 and I got them for $5. So it was definitely a splurge, but um, not like a super expensive splurge. And I'll definitely use all of these this summer. The last couple things we have are some clothes. 
Um, the first thing I got was just a pair of white leggings. Um, I don't didn't have any white leggings that were like this. I have white tights and other things or tan but I didn't have any white ones and I knew with summer and like summer dresses and stuff like sometimes I want to wear a summer dress but it's either a little too cold or um, I need to be a little bit more appropriate like if I'm gonna wear it to work or something so I need to wear something underneath it so um, I thought I would get um, some white ones um, these are from the brand fig and blue um, and they are just regular white leggings nothing fancy about them whatsoever um, the original retail value for them is $16 and I got them for seven dollars so again a great deal I'll get a lot of use out of this um, and hopefully they'll last me a couple of years here and then the next thing I got was a new top, but this is the top I got. It's really long, so I think it'll actually go really well with leggings and everything. Um, I think the top of it is really cute. The um, It's kind of like woven on the top, and then it's like really long and kind of comes up in the middle and then like kind of spreads out and towards the sides. I think it's really, really cute. I think it'll look great with leggings, and it'll be a really great work top. Um, it's from the brand um, Chelsea and Theodore. Um, I got the one in a small. Normally I'm actually a medium, so um, I, just because it's such a large top in general, the small actually worked out for me. The original price of this top was $58 from Chelsea and Theodore, and I got it for $10, so this was definitely a steal. I do feel like the best deals you do get at Burlington are specifically in clothes when it comes to the original price to what you eventually actually pay for. So I think that I'm going to get a lot of really great use out of this top um, and definitely get my money's worth. And I have one more top here. Again, this is another work top um, and a similar style as well. It's another long top and this one is black. Again, I think this has really fun detailing on it. It has this metal bar that goes across um, and then kind of opens up. So it's just kind of really cute. And then it opens up just a tiny bit in the back. So you get a little loophole back there. Um, it's again a very long top so I could wear this with leggings or I could just wear this with some nice jeans or maybe a skirt. This is from the brand AUW. Um, the original retail price for this shirt is $15 and I ended up getting it for $8. So again a really great deal. The, pre um, the fabric is really nice and I think it's going to last a really long time. So again I will definitely get my money's worth out of this top. And then I have one final little thing that I picked up, and it is this cute tiny little mirror here. Um, I have been looking for something like this because um, depending on what I am doing after work, sometimes I'm going out and meeting friends or doing something where I kind of have to look a little fancier than what I do at work. I don't always um, have a full face of makeup on. Usually I, wear, I don't even like put my contacts in me when I go um, into the office. Um, I'll just kind of like get up do my bare minimum and get there because no one really cares necessarily what I look like. If there are like big clients coming in or something, I'll definitely dress up a little more, but for the most part, I'm just kind of bare bonesing it. Um, but if I am needing to do something a little fancier, um, I will kind of get ready at work on my breaks and stuff. Um, it's been kind of annoying where I kind of have to like bring everything to like the bathrooms and stuff though. So I thought I would pick up this little mini mirror here um, so that I could get ready either at my desk or in an empty break break room somewhere. This is from the brand Enma Lux and it is a vanity mirror. Um, it has the both sides where one of them is kind of like the broader one and then it has like the really close up where you can um, see really really well. Originally from Edma Lux, this mirror retails for $13, and I got it for $6. Alright, so that was all of my Burlington haul, so now we're going to move on to my Route 21. Um, Route 21 is not as big, but I definitely still got a decent amount of items from there. I got a couple different outfits, and they had some amazing sales going on today, so um, I saved more money than what I actually spent, which is always the best kind of day to have. Um, so yeah, we'll dig right into these ones as well. The first thing I'm pulling out right away that I picked up are a new pair of shoes. Um, they are some booties. Uh, I think that they are super, super cute. They have some great detailing in the back there. Very, very adorable booties. And then they have the zipper up the top. Um, they are a couple inches tall, probably three inch heels, I would guess. Maybe even three and a half or four. Um, like I said, they're from Route 21 and the brand is the Etcetera brand and I'm a size seven, eight. Um, they had a really great deal where it was buy one get one 50% off when you get new shoes. I think they actually messed up when they um, rang up my order. I think they actually gave me 50% off both pairs I got. 
So we actually ended up saving even more money than I was supposed to, but I wasn't about to say anything because, you know, like, why would I? Um, and I wasn't positive until I got home anyway, so I kind of looked at it a little closer. And maybe it was 50% off all shoes. Maybe if, it, if you bought two, they were both 50% off. And I just read the sale wrong. But if I didn't read the sale right, um, wrong, the guy that helped me was super, super nice, and he gave me 50% off both pairs of shoes I got. So yeah, these are super adorable. Um, so these booties um, originally retailed for $35, so I got them for $17.50. Um, I like that they are kind of like the close knit around the ankles here. Um, I think the fabric's really nice. And they were actually like really comfortable when I was wearing them. So I will get a ton of use out of them this summer. Um, so on the shoe kick, um, I will go right into um, the next pair of shoes. Um, and the next ones I got were um, wedges and they um, are kind of like cute sandal wedges. Um, they are going to be perfect for, for wearing around the office this summer. Um, we're definitely allowed to kind of dress up and wear some fancy heels and stuff and these ones were super comfortable and uh, like will totally work well. These ones are from the brand Wild Diva Lounge. There is a um, strap that goes around the ankle. Um, definitely probably at least a four or five an inch heel there. So it's not something where you're going to go running in these by any means. Um, but they'll be totally fine for walking around the office. Um, again, they had that same deal going as of with the booties. So these ones were originally $30 and so I got them for $15. Um, they also had a really great deal on shorts. Um, so I got some... Um, high rise shorties um they had the deal they had going on for the shorties it was buy one get one free so basically um 50 off if you bought two or you buy one get one free or however you want to look at it um this is the first pair that i got um has a couple um cute rips in the front and they are like i said those high rise ones um I th think that they're super cute. Definitely not something I'll be wearing to work, but they'll be really great for summer outings. Um, and I'm really enjoying that high rise sort of fashion right now because then it kind of like hides some of that belly fat you got. Um, so that is the first pair I got. And then the second pair is another one. Um, these ones are a little bit longer and a little bit more washed out toward the bottom. They have a couple of kind of closed rips there and then they have the double button on the top, which was really, really cute. Um, and yeah, again, definitely not something that's work appropriate, but I will be able to wear them in my free time this summer. These uh, shorts originally retail for $25, so I got two pairs for $25, so they are $12.50 each. So again, a really, really great deal on these. And lastly, I got a couple tops. The um, first top is another great work top I am excited to wear this summer. Um, it had a, it is this gorgeous like teal color and it has this um, kind of like closed opening um, right at the top and it's actually on the back too so super super cute and it has the attached necklace so you don't even have to worry about accessorizing it. Um, it's definitely a longer top um, but it'll go really really well with either some like black slacks or again maybe some leggings or something so it'll I am super excited to wear this um to work or even like at home or with friends this one is from the Rue 21 brand again and it retailed for $15 so I was happy to buy that and then the um other top I got I just absolutely fell in love with from the moment I tried it on I could not believe how cute it was and especially how cute it was with the high rise jeans um, they have the spaghetti straps on top and then it kind of cuts off the shoulder and you have sleeves. It's that very, very lightweight material though where it's almost sheer so um, it is definitely not something that's going to keep you warm. It is great for summer, super, super cute. Kind of like Hawaiian colors which I think is adorable. Um, also at the top if you can see it is kind of crisscrossed right there. Um, so I thought that was a super adorable. Um, just kind of a low hanging back otherwise. And then you can see it kind of has the scrunch um, at the kind of like waist area. This again is from the Rue 21 brand and this was um, uh, $18. Okay guys, so that was absolutely everything as for my haul. Um, like I said, it was kind of really random. A ton of stuff that is going to be great for the summer and spring going forward here and then a bunch of random household items. Let me know what you guys thought of this haul, if you enjoyed it or if you'd like to see things like this in the future. As always, I would love it if you would like the video down below. If you enjoyed watching this, I would really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed my channel in general, feel free to hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out and I would love for you guys to know when my new videos are coming out 
I try to post every single Sunday so once a week you'll get a new video and I kind of do uh, mostly things beauty and fashion related but you also get a couple dance videos in there as well as I am a ballroom dancer so I love bringing that part of my world to you guys. Otherwise I hope you guys have a great spring day and I will see you guys next time. Bye!